They were stuck at sea off the coast of Pasco County in some choppy water. Look at this. And the weather was only getting worse. Well, tonight, a family of four is safe after a daring rescue by the Coast Guard. Fox 13's Aaron Mesmer is at Ballast Point for us. So, Aaron, take us through exactly what happened here. Allie, the, the seas were pretty rough uh, at around noon on Sunday, and we're told that uh, it was about a six or seven foot chop. So it was pretty frightening conditions for this family, but fortunately, they knew how to call for help. Coast Guard video shows a disabled sailboat rocking and bobbing in choppy seas nearly 100 miles off the coast of Anclote Island. A frightened family knew they needed help. They knew their distress signals and, and knew how to get a hold of someone that could help them, which is the biggest thing. Lieutenant Bailey Olds and a crew from the Coast Guard's Clearwater Station flew an MH-60 Jayhawk helicopter out to the boat. A family of four, including two children, ages 3 and 12, was on board. By the time we got there, we kind of already had a plan within our aircraft of how we wanted to make this happen. A Coast Guard swimmer jumped into the water and swam the mother and her two kids away from the boat. Rescue video shows what happened next. Lieutenant Olds co-piloted the Jayhawk as it hovered over the family and then they were hoisted out of the water to safety aboard the chopper. It's not just me, it's not just a fine mechanic, not just a swimmer, it's a, it's a huge effort from every member in the crew. We're told the father was operating the boat and eventually got it back to shore. Meanwhile, Old says he and his crew had just received a lot of practice over land, rescuing people who were stranded during Hurricane Ian. But this was his first hoist rescue over water. It's what we trained for, and um, we can, if we're working together as a crew, we can make it all happen safely. And the Coast Guard says this is a good reminder for boaters to have a, uh, a VHF radio. That's a very high-frequency radio, and that's what this family had, Allie, and they were able to use it to both contact the Coast Guard and then help them find that family when they were out on the, uh, out on the water. Mm, thank goodness for the Coast Guard, that is for sure. Some remarkable video there. All right, Aaron, thanks.